Hey everybody, uh, Red Ted here. And uh, today we're over at West Liberty Lions Club Park. And uh, this is just a beautiful little park. Um, and so what I'm gonna try to do today is give you um, a few scenes of uh, what can go on here at the park. And um, plus show you a little bit of my beautiful silver and sable East German Shepherd dog. Uh, he's my faithful, most loyal buddy. He's a, a beautiful dog, as most people say. And uh, I can't wait to show him to you. So um, I know I got other videos up on YouTube, but each one is uh, just more of the joy that I receive from my own little dog. Okay, thank you. Now here we see one of the attractions here at West Liberty. Old style monkey bars and an old style swing set. A pavilion where people can meet and have picnics. Bruno, get over here. <laughs> and, uh, and then right on the other side, a uh, little bit more of a modern type of slide playground type thing and public restrooms right there. I don't know whether those are flush toilets or vault toilets, never really been inside to look. But uh, nevertheless, a nice facility right here at the uh, Lions Club in West Liberty. Now here we see a softball uh, area and another softball field right over here. Very nice. Kids starting their training for this fall. Probably in their track and field exercises. Okay, now here we have one of the main features of the West Liberty Lions Club Park. We have a small raceway for go-karts. For, um, I'm not sure what all ages it entails. But every Saturday night through a certain, you know, race season, this place fills up with really nice motorhomes, really nice uh, go-karts. They're actually more of a race cart, you know, and they take this stuff pretty seriously with these children. So it's a lot of fun to come over and watch these kids. And uh, you ever get a chance? Look into the Lions Club here in West Liberty. Look up their schedule for racing action right here in West Liberty, Ohio. Okay, this is from down into the uh, first turn and second turn. Looking around over there at the judges stand. And uh, the pit back there underneath the, the uh, awnings. And then the flag stand right here beside me. So uh, this really is a lot of fun. Come over and see it sometime. Now here we see a little area where the kids like to get in and play in the creek. Uh, this is the, I think the Maccacheek Creek. Over there is the Mad River and they come together, which I should have walked over there. And Bruno says, Daddy, I'm going down and get me a drink. Plus, I imagine that water feels good after a hot summer walk like today. Uh, it must feel pretty good. He's staying right in there. <laughs> Don't drink too much. Does that feel good, Bernie? Huh? Does that feel good, boy? Yeah, that feels good, don't it? That's right, shake it off. Shake it off, there you go, buddy. <laughs> oh, the joy of a dog. Now we're almost back to where we started.
Let's go over to the van, and there's the van right over there. Okay, here's where the tag team exists quite a bit. Bruno has helped me put on over 42,000 miles on this van. And it... Come on, buddy. Let's go on back. Okay, that concludes our walk. As you can see, my t-shirt is totally soaked from sweating. But that's, you know, part of the deal on these hot summer days. Uh, anyways, if you uh, enjoyed this video, just leave a like. Uh, I'm not monetizing any of my videos. I don't care about all that. All I want to do is just have a little fun in life and maybe bring a little joy. And remember to uh, give God the credit for all the joy that you receive. And he will give you more. Thank you.